Henry Clay Elementary School in Rolando may soon have a new name. Many parents and community members have been pushing for the name change. Outraged, their neighborhood school honors a former U.S. statesman and slave owner who worked to maintain slavery. CBS 8's Richard Allen has more on the recommended replacement name as well as the school board's reaction. Well, that's right. Two years after a group of community members led the charge to have the name of Henry Clay Elementary School in Rolando changed, the suggested replacement by a district committee, Rolling Hills Leadership Elementary is receiving forceful pushback as well. While the name Rolling Hills did garner some support, we cannot replace one racist name with another with racist Thank roots. You. More than 1,200 people signed the original petition to rename Henry Clay Elementary. Clay was a 19th century congressional representative and slaveholder whose work preserved slavery in the South. But the suggested replacement, the more generic sounding Rolling Hills, has also been rejected by these same community members. The district informed us that the reason for the name Rolling Hills was to honor the indigenous community, which knowing the history of Rolando and Rolling Hills is just altogether absurd. A history that includes racial redlining during the 50s, in which housing developers in Rolando excluded people of color from being able to buy homes. By suggesting that we call this school Rolling Hills and linking it to Rolando and linking it to that history, uh, we think that's just another uh, way of upholding white supremacy and structural racism in the schools. The community also raised concerns about how the name was ultimately chosen by an anonymous names committee appointed by the district. We don't know who was on the names committee. We don't know what their credentials were. We don't know what their uh, what their values were. We don't know what their uh, motivations were. Instead, advocates for the name change say the new name needs to be restorative, many pushing for Bell Hooks Elementary after the renowned feminist author and educator. Rolling Hills is not progress. Choosing Bell Hooks is. Several board members expressed their concerns with how Rolling Hills was selected. This has a funny feel to it, if you will. I want to own that we were not transparent with the community. With calls from teachers for the board to make a decision quickly. The delay on your part has contributed to so many divides in our community. My vote tonight would be for bell hook that's just me i'm one of five and i recognize that and while no vote was taken tonight the board appeared united in trying to make a decision as soon as the next board meeting set for april 30th richard allen cbs 8. thanks richard